to uh, Joni's house together, all of us, and getting Joni ready for her big show at the Hollywood Bowl. And I've always said, Joni played Newport, she played the Gorge, she's going to play Hollywood Bowl, and if she ever played another place, I really think it should be Tanglewood. Daughter, we're playing, we're singing, we're going deep cuts on these songs, and they are like, oh, it's like learning all over again. She's just probably one of the greatest that's ever been, and um, she is the greatest that's ever been. Because she's so innovative, and she's still innovating. Just hearing her reapproach her own vocals to these songs is like a masterclass. Um, anyway, there was a time when. Uh, all I could listen to was blue. Did it, did it, can you guys relate to that? And I did blue, I did blue at, at, at Disney Hall and uh, Carnegie Hall. And uh, I thought I had gotten out of my system, but um, when we made our album, I knew that if I just didn't go full Joni on one song, that I would just do it the whole album and, and that it would be just noticeable. And so I was like, I'm going to do it shamelessly for one song, and then I'm going to beg Johnny's forgiveness. <laughs> so that one song is the one I just played you. Don't do it! That sounds so badly derivative. Uh, we actually wrote it on the, the dulcimer, and, uh, but we, we didn't do it on dulcimer. But I feel like the least I can do if I'm going to run around and sing a Joni derived song is to do, to do one of the ones that actually it came from. So we're going to do a Joni one for you guys. Talk about fairly wills now, the night is a story. Oh, and there are 